Hey everybody, I'm going to show you how to get some pretty strong armor in the very beginning of the game in all armor and weapons in the beginning of the game with Dragons of Dogma. This is right after you get the pawns, um, come back to the main city you started off in, make sure you wait until nightfall. Now, you can also sell these for over, well, quite a lot of money. Uh, you'll see at the end of the video I just sell them and show you. Um, but make sure it's nightfall, turn left, and there's going to be a cutscene. You want to go over here. Um, you want to go exactly where that cutscene was. You can watch if you want. Now, this is very important. Get rid of your pawns. You do not want them to follow you because you're going to perform a, a barrel glitch. And if they come with you, they'll break the barrels. So what I did was just throw their ass into the water. That's all I did. Oh, got a little stuck here. <clears throat> Let's get rid of them and then talk to the lady. You then you have you I would I ask you. I ask you. Alright, now that you're here, um, go to the board. Well, you're going to skip a cutscene first. Skip that cutscene. Um, go to the board, accept all the quests if you want. You can do that. There's a chest right behind it. Sorry if you hear clicking. There's a little bit of a delay. Um, there's going to be a chest right behind that. You can get that and sell that if you want. Or you can equip it. Then you want to come over here. There's going to be another cutscene. I believe that's uh, there's only one more cutscene after this. Kind of annoying. Um... So now you're just going to come in here and there's going to be another chest right in the very side. Now you're going to have to follow me very precisely. So I suggest watching this part before doing it and remembering it. Um, because there are some high level enemies here. So you can get out here or higher level. I don't know how high or low they are. You want to come to that door. You want to ignore the dogs. Jump over here. You're going to run. Turn left. Keep going straight. Straight is where you want to go. Nor those things. Ugly. Turn right. And you're gonna keep going straight. Here should be the last. Well, actually, just one more cutscene after this. Yeah, but you can't skip that one. As you see, I tried skipping it. Um, you just wanna run past it. It's actually very. I just first try on three attempts. Uh, on, on three different characters, I did it first try. It's very easy. Um, so. Oh, you won't be able to even use these weapons, but like these weapons are very strong that you'll be able to get. Now you just want to go through this door. Now here's the last um, cutscene. Alright, we're just going to turn... Turn right right here. Make sure you jump just so you can get this chest. It's very amazing. Very amazing gold. Um. Oh, I'm having trouble. I was having trouble opening it because I had no stamina. Oh, it's a flask of oil. I thought it was gold. Might have been gold. I don't know. I didn't even see. Alright, now in this very first room, um, you're going to open this door. And then you're going to grab a barrel. Barrels are very important to perform this glitch, so you can actually, instead of using a rare item to get through that, you can actually just jump through them. So what you're going to do is you're going to place a barrel down, and you're just going to jump through it. As you can see, sometimes you jump on top of it. Um, all you got to do is just, you got to go back set it down. Right when you set it back down, you can actually go through the barrel for some reason. You want to be through the barrel. You do not want to be um, next to it. You don't want to be doing any of that. You don't want the barrel to be solid. Now, as you can see here, I performed a glitch a little wrong again so just pick it up move it I don't know why I switched barrels but I guess it's so you put it to the very corner go back jump very easy to do you just jump and push forward and boom I jumped over and there are barrels in this room so here open the chest then you got the ring of whatever that said I don't even see it all you gotta do is just put it on the other corner to where the other barrel isn't so you can jump through it 
Just jump. See, sometimes you just do it very first try. It's very easy. Here, I'm gonna need to fix that barrel, I think. Yep. Now, sometimes this happens where you get glitched through and you don't know. You just want to throw the barrel. I, as you can see, I tried being nice and saving the barrel, but just throw it, break the barrels. It's easy. Also, you want the barrel to be more to the corner. You want to be practically like hugging both sides of the like the the wall and then the door. You want to be right there. Go through, jump again. Now sometimes it takes a while. I got lucky with all my jumps. It took I was pretty fast on all of them. So there now you got another good bow. We're just gonna go put this back. And if you happen to break all the barrels, um, just save and quit and reload the area and the barrels will be right back. So you, it's impossible to be stuck in this room forever. Now, since we got that, um, we, there's actually two other doors we can go to. Now, uh, I thought there was one right here, but there wasn't. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Guess I cleared my throat while making this video. <laughs> it's nasty. All right, put it to the very side. Um, we're gonna come back. You can grab anything, like a box, like that's fine. You can even do it with a person. So it's fine. Whatever you use, as long as you carry it. Now I suggest killing the deer because the deer can actually break the barrels, and it got a little too close for comfort for me. So I'll just like I'm just gonna kill you. Make sure you don't break the barrels too or you gotta run all the way back. See, I suck at the game. I'm used to Dark Souls. Alright, all you do is just reset down the barrel, go to the very corner, go through it, just jump. Should be able to get it pretty fast. You just want to tap the j jump button. That's all you want to do. Just tap the jump button. While I'm moving forward. That's not going to work, by the way. That barrel. That won't work. I don't know why I'm still trying it. Yeah, there we go. I realize. There we go. You'll see I jumped through this pretty fast. Yep. Now this this is the final door. So I was actually um sick while making this um the gameplay, so I, I'm a little snotty. Easy. This is the last item. Now we're, I'm gonna actually go sell these and just show you how much money you can get. They're very good items. Um, very strong. Now I'm gonna show you where you can actually just go sell it right there. There's actually a person that just stands there in the very beginning of the area that just happens to sell shit. So. Just come over here, jump, and you're gonna have to jump in. Oh, I almost fell off right there. You're gonna just jump and then run up these stairs. Um, this guy. Go to sell. And boom, look at all of that. Look how valuable that is. That is valuable. I just sold all the items I got here, and that's how much I got. Very valuable. Alright, I hope this video helped you guys out. It's very easy to do, and all you do to get back is talk to the lady, and then she'll take you back. Very easy. Now, I hope this helped you guys out.